Hello again, a new day, the same old project. Today it's Sunday and finally I have some results about using this amplifier hooked on uh, my Heltec Helium Minor. And, uh, well, it's not too much to say. Finally, after a few days of uh, tweaking and, you know, uh, changing antennas and cables and power supplies and whatever, uh, the idea it's good, the project it's nice, but it's not working. Even with the filter at the input of uh, the amplifier, it's not working. I mean, physically it's working, it, it's doing amplification. But the point is, this kind of very cheap amplifiers, they are very noisy in the same time. I couldn't measure exactly the noise level or the noise floor of this one but uh, if you consider that the noise it's applied with the already noise we have from the antenna and cables and so on so it's even uh, making the signal worst I mean dirtier if I may say okay the final conclusion let me check my uh, my activity for the last three days. So um, I think I, I have this on in this area. I had to witness three days ago. Of course, no beacon broadcasted because the amplifier is not uh, bidirectional, so it's only Eric's. Same story, another zero. Here it was just with the antenna and you can see already we have a activity, kind of activity. And then again, here is the amplifier on again. Three beacons, zero of course, because it's not passing through the amplifier and no witnesses for days. I mean, more precisely for two days. Okay, like I said, I tried all kind of antennas. I tried even the original Heltec 3.5 dB. No results. Um, I have a McGill 6 dB, same story. And my uh, collinear coaxial, which is working for sure because I tested for so long, same story. Final. Uh, result or conclusion is that uh, the amplifier is working it can be used for any other kind of project you know like dbs uh, reception uh, fm reception you know uh, maybe short waves or something it's doing the job it's amplifying i mean of course it is but it's not good for this project it's not good for uh, 868 megahertz Maybe, maybe with a better chip, with a better amplifier, low noise amplifier, call it professional amplifier, there will be a kind of result. But for now, I'm, uh, I'm sorry to say that uh, for me at least it's not working. And hopefully this will save you some effort and some uh, days of testing and, uh, you know, hopes also. <laughs> So I uh, wish you well and uh, if you like, please subscribe. Push the like button too, that helps me a lot. Uh, if you are not subscribed yet, please do it. It helps my channel, it helps, it helps my project to, to go on. And uh, by the way, let me show you something. I have my multimeter here, that's from Kwitz, smart multimeter, it's nice robust plastic all around you can drop it no problem it fold like three meters from my pocket down to the floor nothing happens and uh, i really advise you to give a try it's very cheap you have a link at my uh, channel in my channel description and uh, also a discount for this kind of multimeters and um, they are very clever you have the tutorial about this few videos ago so uh, Consider purchase one of these 
and also Kiwi, which they have a lot of other stuffs for sale, really interesting stuffs and good prices for hobbyists and, uh, you know, related stuffs like this. Okay, thank you for now. I'll be back with some other news. And uh, the most important thing, don't forget to have fun. Bye-bye. <laughs>